Okay, here we are looking at another knife. And this is, of course, um, let's see. This is the box it comes in. And my camera don't want to focus too much, but it's all in Russian. Uh, you see it's a model 95, it's 30V carbon fiber and you get the little black cloth with the the bear on it so this is uh from russia is where these are made and shigorov is uh known as a definitely higher end quality knives and are they, are they all that? You also get with it, boom. A little layer of authenticity. Okay. This is the 95 Model T carbon fiber inlays. And you see the, the milling on that carbon fiber does add for grip. And that is a little sticker on that pivot there, so. My camera does not like this nap. <laughs> the one focus seems like. So, what you get, you see the little bar there. Uh, what you get with this nap is excellent blade scenery. the best clip ever ever this is the best clip i've had on any of my flippers um no you can't even feel it in the hand the clip it's not there it's invisible excellent design a little jimp in there on the blade it's s30b I think it's a 3.81 blade, something like that. I could look. Anyway, it's a almost a four inch blade. Uh, comes good and sharp. The titanium on this knife is super smooth everywhere. Lock up, of course, is good, but my camera does not want to focus. There we go. You see the steel insert, and this knife, do you see the ridges there on the carbon fiber? Those really do help believe it or not and you see how that's cut out on the inside and not the outside like a lot of them which is really better uh, to close this knife it's like it has no detent ball which is perfection in my book that's one of my major complaints with all other knives is no matter like say this little statement I got you know it flips great I polished on it and really ingested and all that but still you got that big detent ball on about any knife when you go to close them so Anyway, back to the Shigorov. Uh, 
these knives are that good, in my opinion. They are expensive, yes, but you will not be disappointed. If you can pick these up right now at Knife Center and other places, the internet, eBay, these models are pretty easy to get. <coughs> Excuse me, other ones are not. Um, just as far as knives go, this is as close to perfection as you are going to get. Flips better than any, and closes better than any, and feels better due to all the work they put into this titanium, which is really just a bunch of hand rubbing and a little sanding if other knife makers would do it. It don't take that long and it would make their knives twice better. But anyway, see cool little backspacer there, or standoff. And no hot spots, no sharpness, no word. Really smooth knife, real well rounded everywhere, so there's no roughness. And you can just touch it and it flips. So, if you was like me, he's like, man, I hate to spend that kind of money on a knife and said I never would. But, once I did, I had to admit it was the right thing to do, if you really like knives. Uh, this is uh, just uh, definitely, Shigorov has won me over to they're the best. And this is just their mid deck. And of course, their customs are even better, but <clears throat> this is as close as, I mean, just so smooth. I mean, that's the way a knife should be. I am definitely a Shigorov fan now. So, yeah, they're a little pricey, but honestly, these knives will make you want to throw your other knives away or sell them. It's kind of like driving a, let me give you a good comparison in vehicles. Uh, it's kind of like driving a, say, a, a Chevy Cobalt, and then you jump in behind the wheel of a big BMW 6 Series. That's the difference. You are going way above in many areas, and uh, you're just getting quality. And you're going to have to pay for that quality, but the quality's worth it. Because then you'll start looking at your other knives and really be saying, well, they're just not in the same class at all. So definitely a winner. Uh, they hold their value good. So that is a plus. But once you get one of these, you won't want to sell it, more than likely. Just the action is so good on these, and they feel so good in the hand. The 95T is definitely their flagship model, from what I understand. Um, and you can get these in the turtle shell, which I'm sure you've seen. Um, if you've not, you can go online and 
see all about them. But you know what these is if you're watching this video. Don't buy the Chinese knockoffs because uh, to me that just gives Shigor off a bad name. And these guys put out quality knives that function really well, feel excellent in the hand, and definitely what impresses me most about this knife, to be honest, is really about the way it feels. Because the titanium is so unlike, say, something, I mean, I'm not trying to put down Riyake, and I really like his knives. Uh, but just, you know, when you, it's just, it's not there. And many other titanium knives I got. So, Shigorov has made a believer out of me. You would say, well, would you buy another one? Even knowing they're that expensive. If I had the extra money, yeah, I would. Because if you know knives, you know you've got something you've got a shigore off that works the way a knife should, the way you would want a knife to work, to feel good, to be smooth action, easy closing, and feel great in the hand and look good doing it. So there you go. Nothing bad to say about this knife. I couldn't really find nothing wrong with it whatsoever. And you really shouldn't when you're paying that kind of money for them. These knives are just excellent. So there you go. I hope you enjoyed it, looking at it. So if you're thinking about buying one, if you can't afford it, you're really wanting to do it, you're going to be happy with what you get. Just make sure you get a real one. And uh, have a good day, and we'll see y'all on the next knife review, which will be coming right at you soon. Uh, I'm going to be doing a couple more. And then I'm going to try to get me some more Shigorovs. And honestly, I'm thinking of selling a lot of my knives and buying some of these. That's how good these are. I mean, they're that daggone good. So have a good one, and we'll see you next time. And keep napping, y'all.